A Queensland man is celebrating making polar history, kite skiing across Antarctica in the longest solo journey. For 58 days, Jeff Wilson fought fatigue, frostbite and oxygen deprivation. Leaving the sunny beaches of the Gold Coast, for this, Dr Jeff Wilson has done what many thought impossible. Kite skiing across Antarctica with a 200 kilogram sled in tow as temperatures drop to minus 40 degrees. Okay, it's the middle of the night, um, I see about midnight. The 49 year old fought fatigue, frostbite, hypothermia, hallucinations, and conditions so icy at some stages the only way forward was to crawl. I had a very low point around 30 days at the base of Dome Argus, which was probably the toughest part. Just seemed it would never be possible. Raising money for the McGrath Foundation, Jeff's journey began November 9 at Thor's Hammer near Russian base Nova Lazarevskaya. He travelled for 23 days to the aptly named Pole of Inaccessibility, becoming the first person to reach its summit solo. All up, a 58-day round trip, 5,306 kilometres in total. We're coming home. 780 kilometres to go. Considering what I've been through and what we've achieved, just very, very glad to be finished and alive and well. Safely back at his Russian base, Jeff says the first thing he wanted was a long, hot shower, followed by a beer. Oh, yeah. We're betting it'll be a cold one.